Hello, and welcome to part three of Sons of Doom. That's, yeah, that's what it is. Um, so basically, uh, I've started over, as uh, last time ended rather poorly, we'll say. Uh, but I'm pretty sure I know what to do now. So this should be, this should be it. This should be the mighty conclusion that we've all been waiting for. All of us, yes. I believe that's the case, so we'll see. Um, yeah, sounds it sounds good to me. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've got this. Okay, so let's see. I got my cobblestone. I got everything I need. I should be good to go. I don't think I really need to collect anything. I might need to collect a bit of sand. I think, actually, that's probably not a bad idea. A bit of sand is always good to have. It's handy. Very handy to have sand. I, I, which is a little bit ironic how much sand you need in this game when uh, when you think about it because it's supposed to be afraid of the sounds of doom. I don't know. But uh, yeah, so we'll see. I do happen to know the shortcut. Uh, there might be two. Might just be one, but I think there's probably two. It actually uses the shovel. But the first shortcut, at least, to get into the temple, I can bypass that dreadful first bit of lava. So that saves a bit of sand, but <clears throat> I do need more sand, I'm pretty sure, to get down to the portal making area. So that'll be fun. So yeah, here we go. Uh, if I, I can't quite remember. See, I think I can just dig here. Yeah, there we go. There we go. How oh, nice. Lovely. Excellent. Okay, so here we are. Uh, I think I just dig a sand block. Yep, just like that. And then I can just go. Whoops. Oh, that'll work. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. Okay, so I just need to, I think I just go this way. And then all things will be re good. Come on. Oh, oops. Yeah, it's right over there. Oh, I don't want to get too close to that lava. That lava. It's kind of scary. There we go. Alright. Ow. Yeah, so there we go. Get my flint and steel, my first chunk chunks of its obsidian, and uh, let's see how do I do this again? I think I just need to mine down in what is a reasonable manner. Just get things going nice and smooth. That's caught on fire. It's not good. Okay. So here we go. You know, this really isn't that long of a map once you uh, figure it out, I think. It's fairly quick, but I've probably lodged a good... I'm just kind of guessing here, but... Mm, four, maybe five hours on the map? It's been fun, it's been fun. It's definitely a frustrating map, but it has been fun. I will we'll give it that. Okay, so let's see here. I think what I'm supposed to do, and I think... Well, let's use sand. Uh, Go. I think that's all I gotta do. Right. Let's just uh, stop the flow of lava so I can dig down. And there's one point where I think if I, I think yeah, I'm fairly convinced of this that there's gonna be a point where sand won't fill things up. But okay, so here we go. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I can just do this now. Kind of big, dig down a little bit. I'm doing this just to be as safe as I can because this game is quite punishing. There we go. There we go. I got down safe. And right, I got my diamond pickaxe and I got my obsidian. Time to make this bad boy portal. And then, uh, just go to the nether. Try to win the game. Pretty sure what happened last time. Uh, basically was this though basically uh, son of a, okay yeah basically what happened would be I I blew up the treasure <laughs> I'm assuming in the final trap because the notes the game notes right they say um, if you blow up the treasure in the final trap then uh, you have to restart with a brand new uh, level so um, that seems likely to me to be the case of what happened. So I'm just going to grab a bit of netherrack here. And I'm pretty sure I just need to figure out how, right, 
to uh, not set off all that TNT in that lovely pyramid over there. Because that was a lot of TNT, and there's really nothing else. I explored quite a bit of the nether um, after the last video ended, that, and it was really fruitless. There was nothing. I couldn't find a thing. So I, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure, certain on my conclusion that this is what I have to do. So okay, so I just need to uh, figure this out. Okay, so I walked in, and this is the doorway. So I walked in, and uh, see, I'm pretty sure there's lava up there. Uh oh, that's not good. Uh, that'll work. Oh, oh okay. All right. Didn't mean to do that. Sand. Oh, okay, so, um, I walked in, right? And I just, there we go. I walked in and it set it off. So I'm thinking of something to do with the sand. Uh, that seems a bit likely. I don't want to walk on the sand. Can I walk? Can I make it? Oh, no, I can't. Okay. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Okay, there we go. Um, yeah. Apparently there's a gas down here somewhere, so that's not good. Uh, okay, so I think... I think what it is is the sand is going to fall, and that, that will cause some issues. So let's try to not build where the sand is. That seems doable. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, can I go this way? Okay, I, I, I can go this way. Okay, here we go. Okay, so this is this should be doable then, right? I should just be able to... Uh, to step over to that, right? Can I just can I dig a little? Okay, well, I can basically dig a little, but I just need to uh, place some blocks in there. Okay, maybe that's not... You're supposed to do it like that, maybe? That, that might be what it is. Okay, here we go. There we go, there we go. Alright, so now I think I'm good. I think I can just, like, bypass the sand directly now, so... And uh, I'm assuming the treasure is probably... There's all that obsidian in there, so I kind of feel like it's probably inside of the obsidian. I'm kind of... I'm not really certain what will happen when I walk in here, but... Yeah, there's all this sand. I'm afraid of the sand. I'm very afraid of the sand. I think I can just break this wall. Here we go. I, I don't I don't know if, I, if stepping on sand will set it off or what, but... Definitely afraid of sand, so... I'm just going to try to avoid it and see if there's treasure inside of this obsidian bit, which seems very likely, maybe, we'll see. <laughs> I really don't want to stand anywhere near the uh, sand, so... And that gas is just like whining away out there. I wonder if he, like, if that gas shot in here, he'd probably blow the whole thing up. Yep! Yeah, treasure! <laughs> I found it! I'm pretty sure this is it. I, I, I think this is it. Look at this. I got some diamond boots. 30 diamonds, a diamond helmet, some diamond armor, some diamond leggings. Look at that, 64 cooked pork chop, 20 ladders, oh my god, and 100 TNT. If this isn't the treasure, I don't know what is. Uh, definitely the treasure. Let's see here, let's put on... What? <laughs> is that... I don't think it's supposed to work like that. I don't, yeah, I don't think it's supposed to, like, let me put stacks of diamond helmets on. Alright, uh... Well, that's cool. Yeah, I'm not gonna complain about that. <laughs> Alright, so... Okay, well, I gotta test out my hypothesis here, so... Let's come over here... And see what happens when I break a bit of sand. Right, I mean, that... Because I'm pretty sure I got the treasure. I get, okay, maybe I didn't get the treasure. Maybe there's more. But... I don't know. I don't know. Can I walk on the sand? I can walk on the sand. It's no problem. Here. Oh shit, okay, uh, run, 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 oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, where am I, where am I, I can't see anything. Well, um, that's probably the treasure, so, uh, yeah.